Sporty Nerdigans, this is the one and only Packer Girl 89 in today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Black Clover chapter 292 and last chapter, let's be real, Dante's reaction was probably the majority of the fandom's reaction to um, Magna saying, look, I'm going to take you on by myself. He felt, he, he felt bad because he was, you know, Manga was so weak, and he was like, you know what? I ain't even gonna waste my magic on you, but I'll give you a free shot. And boy, did that backfire. And oh, looking at this first panel, and I should have realized this last, last chapter, but man, Sora, you sneaky, sneaky, sneaky little shit. This, this attack has Sora's name written all over it. Because if you can't get to your opponent's level of mana, why not bring it down to yours? And also absorb it in the process. <laughs> this is so Sora. Anyway, let's get to this chapter and see what's in store for us this week. And this chapter is titled Knowing. Six months ago, I'm begging you, teach me how to fight like you. In the Heart Kingdom, they told me my magic was too low and I couldn't use a mana method to fight. You're a peasant like me, though, and from what I saw, you made it happen. Especially the one that doubles stuff and kicks it back. That was awesome. Uh, your magic's low, but you can fight. Come on, please. Dude, that face from Zora is everything. That darn luck's gonna get even stronger. I can't let that guy pull ahead of me. Anybody but him. And also, I can't drag the Black Bulls down. A peasant with flame magic who's a magic knight, huh? I don't want to watch you grovel. I'll teach... <laughs> Seriously. Of course Sora's saying this. Um, because that's what his father had. His father had flame magic, so... I don't want to watch you grovel. I'll teach you. Just knock that off. For real? Yeah, yeah. He doesn't want him, he doesn't want to have to deal with the PTSD. Anyway, we might have a better shot um, at discovering something new together anyway. Come with me, uh, come with me a minute. Yes, sir. What's this? Woo! It's my secret base, Key! <laughs> it's my secret base! <laughs> Sorry! I like you what you're doing with this secret base. He's planning all his traps up in there. I've been looking for my ultimate self for ages, too. The ultimate trap! You, um, you called it. I do use that, um, mana method thing, but... From what I hear in the Heart Kingdom, they put mana method together on the spot and, um, and make it part of, uh, the fight they're in. To use that style, you need a ton of magic, good instincts, and fast reflexes. I'm a peasant. I've got none of that stuff. Sora, shut up! You do! You... You... You got... Dude, Sora, shut up. You're selling yourself short. Because you got good instincts, and you got fast reflexes with your trap magic. And you do have a ton... He does have a ton of magic. He does. So, stop selling yourself short, Sora. Yami chose you to come to the Black Bulls. He recruited you to the Black Bulls for a reason. I'm a peasant. I've got none of that stuff. All I can do is put the arrays together slowly beforehand. That um, That's especially true for powerful ones like that counter trap spell. Us peasants have an advantage of our own, though. Runes we make with our puny magic are so puny that they just stick around. That means we can take a ton of time and build super complicated arrays in advance. Sora. I still think Sora is so... Maybe it's just me being biased, but... Sora, you have... You have good instincts, man! To do that, though, we have to know more about mana and ourselves. With that, um... What that takes is studying and slow, boring drudge work. That is very true. Can't... You're obviously dumb and impatient. Think you can do it? Ooh! I've always used spells uh, without giving them much thought, but the more I learn about mana, the more there is to know. 
me and that attribute are totally... I don't think I could do do the double it and uh, kick back thing. How do I beat an opponent with stupid huge magic? If I had uh, if I had magic that was just as awesome, I'd win on sheer grit. But I, <gasps> yo Sora, my man, how about this array? Uh, who's your man? Dude, that is a major no homo moment right there. Sora, you missed out on saying that better have been no homo, but that's okay. This had never even occurred to me, but it just might work. Dude! I was wrong and Magna came up with that? Damn, Magna! I will give you props for this. Well, that's really intriguing. Although, it's probably going to take a ludicrous amount of time and patience to make. It took me half a year to uh, make it. I managed it because of me. Because I'm me. Come on, it ain't that complicated. Um, a one-time only spell that's mine alone. Ooh, so this is a one-time spell. All right. This looks really... Oh, these ruins. These ruins look good. But man, I will give Magna credit where credit is due. I just linked us up and split our magic equally. Secret flame magic, soul chain, death magic. Let me give you a heads up. That chain is our souls. If you yank it out or break it, you'll go insane, so better be careful. Dude, Dante is already insane. What are you talking about, man? What the? No way could a peasant use it. No way could a peasant use a spell like that. Dude. Motherfucker's underestimating the power of the human spirit. Thing is, though, he did it. If we attack from out here, it'll mess with that spell's effect. So just watch, all right? Um. This is now his fight. Ooh. So that meant. So that's why. Zora not in this fight. This is all um, a magna, but I will say this before we continue. <laughs> this truly explains why my boy uh, Sora troll. <laughs> Gravity magic, heavy and fighting. Woo. Hey, didn't you say I could attack you as much as I wanted? Um, uh, sorry. Hey, didn't you say I could attack you as much as I wanted, huh, Chief? Shut your mouth, you filthy thief! Dude! Gravity magic presence of the Demon King! We got the same amount of magic! I can buckle down and take this! Magna, you are underestimating Dante! Dante at 100%! He's like basically 100%. Pose well, I don't even. I, and I've been. Actually, you know what? Gotta take this back for a second here. I said, remember what I said a while ago when we first got this transformation? I said, this better be base form because it did not look complete. Ooh, if I get my manga nerdian theory, tinfoil hat manga nerdian theory proven right right now, I will be so happy. Er <laughs> Dude, no matter what you do, as long as I can regenerate with body magic, you'll never manage to defeat me. Get down on your knees and regret that you got above yourself and defied me. <laughs> Even if it put you on your knees, you struggled and continued to fight. You kept the smoldering fire burning and kept preparing right up till today. It doesn't matter if your opponent's the enemy boss, um, or a devil host, or immortal. Witness, Magda! Yes! What a Magda! Dude! I don't know, man. I... I... I'm really root... This is how good Tobias' writing is. I am really rooting for Magna. I'm really rooting for Magna, but there's one thing that wasn't mentioned up in here. And I'm very curious about this. Is how long this spell is going to last. There's got to be a time limit on this. The spell cannot last forever. 
there's got to be a time limit on it. And once that chain breaks, Magna gonna die once that chain breaks. And someone gonna be, but someone gotta make it up in here before that chain breaks. If it's like a 30 minute thing and asked to come up in here and finish the job, okay, that would be, in this case, that would be one of those things where I'd be like, okay, Asta can, Asta can do that. I'd be fine with Asta get, this is where I'm really fine with Asta getting the kill. Asta deserves this kill on Dante. He does. That's why I'm just like, that's why I keep thinking, yeah, there, there's got to be a time limit on this. There has to be, but man... This better be a base form. There has to be a base form to this. Because as Dante said, I don't think Dante using, he's barely using any of his magic. And remember, he's, he's only at 50% power because of what happened with the soul chain. If he has to, like, power up even more, he has to use even more of the devil, uh, of um, his devil host, or, wait. Not devil host, I'm sorry. He has to use even more of the devil, ma of the devil magic. Hold on a second. Let me see. Yeah, I said, dumb, okay, I was right about dumb post. I was, I don't know why I was just like brain fried for a second. But just something telling me Dante is going to get a transformation. Because remember, as I said, this is a base form. Or at least I hope this is a base form. My tinfoil hat theory is that this is a base form and there's, there's going to be more to this. I really hope so. Because remember, I was right for some of the forms that they were base forms. Damn straight. Anyway, I'm really curious what you guys think. Do you guys think that, um, that there's a time limit on this ruin and that this, that this ruin at most is going to last Oh man, I don't think it's gonna, I don't, based on the fact that we're dealing with a devil host like Dante, I don't even think it's gonna last 30 minutes. In all reality, that's being generous. Really is. Because that devil, because I don't know if Magna and Zora took into account um, this situation where um, they would be dealing with a devil this um, with the dark triad being at 100%. I would say that maybe we would be lucky you gener I'm, as, as I said, I'm being generous by saying 30 minutes. I would say if Dante powers up even more, I don't think the ruin's going to last more, more than 10 minutes. I will say that. I'm going to go with 10, between 10 to 30 minutes. Maybe five. Anyway, I think... I really want to say anywhere between five to um, 30 minutes, depending on how much Dante powers up. But if we get a full on transformation, yeah, that room's going to be destroyed instantly. If Dante manages to get back up to 100% and, you know, get a full on transformation to boot, mm, Nah, that rune is going to break. Oh, it will break.
But the other thing I will say that I do like about this ruin is that it is a one-time thing. So if Magna does get the kill, I would not be too mad about it, but it's not going to happen. That ruin is not going to endure this. In no way. No way it's going to endure this. Anyway, I'm very curious about what you guys um, thought of this chapter. What do you guys think about um, how peasant ma uh, magic was broken down like this? I really love how Sora, I love Sora's hideout. I do. I love how Sora plans everything out like this. But I just don't think they, I don't know if Sora planned for this though. I don't know if Magna and Sora planned for, um, for the situation and if they did i don't know if again that's why i said maybe 30 minutes to be honest I, and if they did plan for this then um i think they're i even if they did plan for this i think they're underestimating this power oh damn straight if they planned for this they definitely definitely under they're underestimating dante if they did plan for Dante to be um, at 100% already and for Dante to power back up to 100%. That's what, that's what my line of thinking is. Very curious what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigans Inc. If you love what I'm doing and want to help keep this channel alive so I can keep bringing you more Black Clover content, there's a few ways you could do that. You can donate to my Cash App, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off my Amazon wish list. All that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow me on Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, from me on PlayStation Network. That's in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I'll be seeing you later. Bye.